Bionicle Colgate is a game released in 2004 for LEGO by Colgate, the teeth-making company. With the start of Metro Nui and a new story, LEGO feared they had turned their fan base into casuals and family gamers with too many mask-matching games. In response to this casuality, they hired Colgate to create an insanely hardcore game. And thus, Bionicle Colgate was born. It, along with games like Halo 2, turned the world on its head with its difficulty. In retrospect, it has been compared to the likes of Dark Souls because of its time-consuming and unforgiving dungeon crawling. And I agree. In fact, critics like Greg Farshty said, well, actually, Greg Farshty didn't comment on it because he said, Okay, yeah. I gotta get to bed, guys. Before I could ask him if he had played it. You play as Vakama, Matau, and Wanua, battling impossible enemies like fireballs, spinning fans and flying boulders. The only way to get money in this game is to find the rare coin where they lay. I've personally found this game to be frustrating, yet oddly addicting. I've spent over 60 hours in this game, and I don't think I've even got that far into it. I won't say I'm a veteran of games like these, but I think I'm right when I say this game has a steep learning curve. I'm going to keep on playing until I reach that final Kanoka disc screen, but I don't know how many more fireballs I can take to the face before I rage quit. I can't believe Bionicle's fanbase got shaped into being hardcore playing a game by a company that makes teeth.